Your thyroid is a small, butterfly-shaped gland situated at the base of the front of your neck. It creates and produces hormones that play a role in many different systems throughout your body. When the thyroid makes either too much or too little of these, it's called a thyroid disease. There are several different types of thyroid disease, the most common ones being hyperthyroidism, hypothyroidism, thyroiditis, and Hashimoto's disease. When your thyroid doesn't work properly, it can impact your entire body. If your body makes too much thyroid hormone, you can develop a condition called hyperthyroidism. When your body does not have enough thyroid hormone, it's called hypothyroidism. Both conditions are serious and need to be treated by your healthcare provider. Your thyroid has one of the most important roles within your body. It is responsible for releasing and controlling hormones that control metabolism, the process where the food you take into your body is transformed into energy. Think of your metabolism as a generator. It takes in raw energy and uses it to power something bigger. The thyroid controls your metabolism with some very specific hormones. T4, which is short for thyroxine, a hormone that contains four iodide atoms. T3 is triiodotheronine, a hormone that contains three iodide atoms. These two hormones are created by the thyroid, and they help the body's cells determine how much energy to use. As the hormones are used, the thyroid creates replacements. Your thyroid gland is regulated by the pituitary gland, which is located in the center of the skull, below your brain. The pituitary gland monitors the level of thyroid hormones in your bloodstream. When the pituitary gland senses an imbalance of thyroid hormones in your body, it will adjust the levels with its own hormone. This hormone is called thyroid stimulating hormone, commonly known as TSH. The pituitary gland sends TSH to the thyroid to tell the thyroid what needs to be done to get the body back to normal. Let's define thyroid disease. Thyroid disease is a general term for any medical condition that keeps your thyroid from making the right amount of hormones. When the thyroid makes too much thyroid hormone, your body uses energy too quickly. This is called hyperthyroidism. In this condition you will always be tired, it can make your heart beat faster, you will experience weight loss without trying, and typically feel nervous. If your thyroid doesn't make enough thyroid hormone, this is called hypothyroidism. Insufficient thyroid hormone in your body can make you feel tired, you might gain weight, and it's very difficult for you to tolerate cold temperatures. These two disorders can be caused by a variety of conditions. Most commonly, they are passed down through families. Thyroid disease can affect anyone, it can be present at birth, or it can develop as you age. However, the most common occurrence is after menopause in women. In fact, a woman is about five to eight times more likely to be diagnosed with a thyroid condition than a man. You may be at a higher risk of developing a thyroid disease if you have a family history of thyroid disease, have certain medical conditions such as pernicious anemia, type 1 diabetes, primary adrenal insufficiency, or lupus. Take a medication that's high in iodine. Are older than 60, especially in women. Have had treatment for a past thyroid condition or cancer. Hypothyroidism and hyperthyroidism can be caused by any disease that impacts the way the thyroid gland works. The most common conditions that can cause hypothyroidism include thyroiditis, which is inflammation or swelling of the thyroid gland. Hashimoto's thyroiditis, an autoimmune condition where the body's cells attack and damage the thyroid. Postpartum thyroiditis, which occurs in 5% to 9% of women after childbirth. This is usually a temporary condition. Iodine deficiency. Iodine is needed for the thyroid to produce hormones. Iodine deficiency is an issue that affects several million people around the world. A non-functioning thyroid gland. For some people, the thyroid gland doesn't work properly from birth. If left untreated, the child could have both physical and mental issues in the future. Conditions that can cause hyperthyroidism include Graves disease. In this condition, the entire thyroid gland might be overactive and produces too much hormone. Its identifying characteristic is an enlarged thyroid gland, also called diffuse toxic goiter. Nodules. Hyperthyroidism can be caused by nodules that are overactive within the thyroid gland. Thyroiditis. 
This disorder can be painful in some cases, while others may feel nothing at all. The thyroid can be attacked by different agents such as antibodies, drugs, radiation, bacteria or viruses. The attacks cause inflammation and injury to the thyroid cells. Excessive Iodine When you have too much iodine in your body, the thyroid makes more thyroid hormones than it needs. The symptoms of thyroid disease are varied. Unfortunately, symptoms of a thyroid condition are often very similar to the signs of other medical conditions and stages of life. This can make it difficult to determine if your symptoms are related to a thyroid issue or something else entirely. Symptoms of hyperthyroidism can include anxiety, irritability, and nervousness, trouble sleeping, unexplained weight loss, an enlarged thyroid gland or a goiter, muscle weakness and tremors, irregular menstrual periods or having your menstrual cycle stop, sensitivity to heat, vision problems or eye irritation. Symptoms of hypothyroidism can include fatigue, gaining weight, forgetfulness, frequent and heavy menstrual periods, dry and coarse hair, a hoarse voice, intolerance to cold temperatures, did you know that thyroid issues make you lose your hair? Hair loss is a common symptom of thyroid disease, particularly hypothyroidism. If you start to experience hair loss or you are concerned about it, talk to your healthcare provider. Did you know that there is a five-step thyroid neck check self-exam? Ensuring that your thyroid gland is healthy and functioning properly is vital to your overall well-being. It's easy to mistake thyroid disease for other problems because the symptoms are similar to those of many other conditions. Some of the most common signs are fatigue or trouble sleeping, a fast or irregular heartbeat, unexplained weight changes, and pain or weakness in the joints or muscles. The good news is that it's easy to check for thyroid problems. If you suspect thyroid problems, it's pretty simple to perform your own thyroid neck check at home. All you will need is a mirror and a glass of water. 1. With your face close to the mirror, focus on the lower front area of your neck, above the collarbones and below the voice box, larynx. Your thyroid gland is located in this area of your neck. 2. While focusing on this area in the mirror, tip your head back. 3. Take a drink of water and swallow. 4. As you swallow, look at your neck. Check for any bulges or protrusions in this area when you swallow. Be careful not to confuse the Adam's apple with the thyroid gland. The thyroid gland is located further down on your neck, closer to the collarbone. You may want to repeat this process several times. 5. If you see any bulges or protrusions in this area, consult your physician. You may have an enlarged thyroid gland or a thyroid nodule that should be checked to determine whether further evaluation is needed. Your doctor can perform a simple blood test to look for irregularities. We enjoy bringing these videos to you. If they are helpful to you, please hit the like button. Now we will explain how thyroid disease is treated. Your healthcare provider's goal is to return your thyroid hormone levels to normal. This can be done in a variety of ways. Each specific treatment will depend on the cause of your thyroid condition. Treatment options for hyperthyroidism can include Antithyroid drugs that stop your thyroid from making hormones Radioactive iodine treatment Beta blockers These medications don't change the level of hormones, they help control your symptoms. Surgery If the condition is extreme, your healthcare provider may need to surgically remove your thyroid. In such case, you will need to take thyroid replacement hormones for the rest of your life. Treatment for hypothyroidism is primarily thyroid replacement medication. This is a synthetic drug that adds thyroid hormones back into your body. By using this medication, you can control thyroid disease and live a normal life. Let's talk about living a normal life with a thyroid disease. Thyroid disease is often a lifelong medical condition that you will need to manage constantly. Most commonly, this involves a daily medication. Your healthcare provider will monitor your treatments and make adjustments if necessary. However, you can usually live a normal life with a thyroid disease. It may take some time to find the right treatment option, but then people with these types of conditions can usually live life without many restrictions. 
We have enjoyed bringing you another video, and thank you for watching this to the end. The tips and suggestions mentioned in this video are for general information purposes only, and should not be construed as professional medical advice. If you are concerned that you may have a thyroid condition, it's important to consult with your physician to ensure that you have a clear understanding of your personal situation from a medical and mental health standpoint. If there is a health or wellness subject you would like to know more about, leave us a comment and we'll be happy to put together a video.